Cream of the stream is just an occasional feature where we just draw to your attention something that's uh, it's always online. It's usually on Netflix or Amazon Prime or uh, one of those. But this one is slightly different because it's just available on YouTube. And yes. Uh, Riz Ahmed, uh, you may well have read or heard about this uh, already. He has done a film, it's like a 12-minute film, which you can find on YouTube. And you can, if you follow Riz Ahmed on Twitter, it's uh, it's just there. That's probably the easiest for doing So it's uh, directed by Anil Career and who, who co-wrote it with Riz Ahmed, who is credited with creating it and, of course, stars in it. And it's funny, we were just talking about this before. You may already have heard stuff about it because there's been quite a lot of news coverage about it. If you haven't, the best advice is to just go and find it now and find you know do it either through twitter or you can go through youtube wherever it is and watch it without having read anything about it it's a very very powerful piece it's called the long goodbye and um it's a sort of uh, a quite bold and challenging statement about uh, islamophobia but that's kind of all you need to know about it because the way it works is just at the beginning of it, you're just in a household with, you know, people behaving in a way which seems to be completely sort of natural and brothers, sisters, parents, grandparents. Yeah, arguing about sticking stuff up on a wall, you're standing in front of the television, you're in my oh, shall I do the cleaning up? Blah, 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 blah. And then the film then goes into an area which you don't expect. And the more you don't know about it, so let's not spoil the exactly. I mean, in a way, someone else said to me, it's like parasite, in as much as yeah. The less you know about it, the better. Also, yeah. you know when you start, because you click on it, that it lasts 12 minutes. Yeah, exactly. And it gets to halfway through and you're thinking, well, okay, this is this is quite engaging, but what on it, what's all the fuss about? Yeah. And then it yeah. does what And it then does. you get to the end and you go, well, I thought it was really powerful. I thought it was, I mean, genuinely quite alarming uh, and very powerfully done. I love the way in which it uses... You know, poetry and uh, the naturalistic drama then turns into something which is poetic and rapping and the poetry that's within the the dialogue, within the speech of the piece itself. So I'm trying really hard not to give anything away about it. Um, it's quite unflinching. It's... Uh, it is, I think, very, very strong. I mean, it's it, it's it's one of those short films that does exactly what a short film should do. It uses the short film format to make a really punchy, really sort of, you know, singular, hard-hitting point. And also, I mean, just on a sort of technical level, I thought it was made really well, but there was no point, no point in it that I was ever conscious of watching it as a how well-made is this piece. I was just completely swept yeah. up in it and the story that it was telling. You know, I was never thinking, oh, well, that's well acted or that's well done. Just that this is really, really affecting. Two days' work, apparently. Wow. They did the whole thing in two days. In two days to shoot? Yes. Yeah, OK. Yeah. And then I imagine sort of, you know, more in editing and everything. One, one, uh, what, what on earth was that noise? It wasn't me. Was it you? Or was it the central line? It was one of the two of them. Um, one thing I would say is if you're, if you're watching it on, um, computer or something but listen to it, watch it with headphones yes, because the, the, the it is very important that you get the full impact of the soundtrack it's not something you want to hear coming out of a tinny little speaker you want to have i know people everyone's got headphones nowadays it's a bit of a revelation for me also watch it on your own don't you know it, oh yeah yeah it, it's not a fa it's not a family piece no it's not it, it's you just want to be watching it you don't want to be talking about it whilst it's going on 12 minutes it, it is absolutely worth 12 minutes of your life and then afterwards it will be 12 hours of discussion yes because it's it doesn't feel like it's 12 minutes i mean no. it is 12 minutes because you can see and that's how long it lasts but it feels like it's a whole movie yeah, yeah. worth yeah yeah no he has more ideas in it than many full-length movies and very very well you know like i said really yeah very very powerful go and watch it before we spoil it for you it's called the long goodbye you can find it either on riz ahmed's twitter feed or you can google it you can find it on the youtube or vimeo i imagine all the yeah. all the usual outlets it's a fabulous piece